Um, let's get going. Um, I'm, I'm not good at editing, so you're going to see a lot of images very quickly. Uh, I, I had a really, really bad teacher um, it, <laughs> when I was in college. They, they communicated to me that if I used any more than three typefaces that I was a terrible person, and it really held me back for a very, very long time. And then I was lucky enough to have uh, um, two excellent teachers, Phil Baines and Catherine Dixon, who, who, who relieved, they took so much of that weight off my shoulders and they made type fun again. They opened the door uh, to type and, and in my mind, and, and they, they, it was a simple trick. They invited me um, to look at letter forms as if they were pers personalities, people almost. Um, and it, it just flipped everything around and all of a sudden this thing was fun and um, expressive and, and I was able to interact with it and pull it apart and have fun. Um, and it sort of changes everything. You never look at type the same way again. Um, this is, I didn't design this. I definitely didn't design this. This is a, a logo for Price Waterhouse Coopers. This is a big accountancy firm uh, in England. And I just find it really strange that Price and Coopers get this quite you know, straight treatment, whereas Waterhouse has this, this jumpy baseline. It almost communicates that Waterhouse is some sort of buffoon, or is, he shouldn't be allowed into meetings because his trousers might fall down or something. But so you, it just changes everything. So that, that's very much the space that I'm, uh, I'm in, in my head. <laughs> um, so, you know, this is, a, this is what I do. It's working with letter forms um, and, and trying to kind of give them a charge, really, specifically to work on book covers. I, I mainly work on, on book covers for very, very commercial publishing houses. Um, and I'm just interested in this idea of holding back, you know, not showing you what a character looks like, not stealing that... that, that